out today. John Stape, A Legacy of Evil. Hope! Well, I won't read it, mate. No, I just need to find a way to stop the rest of Weatherfield. One way to do that. We may come, said I could... Ah! What, are you OK? What? I went to the bookshop, bought all the stock, every single copy of the book. Got this, got all the posters. I'll... I'll burn it. Sam's going to be back in a minute. I was going to take him for tea. Hope would like to join us. I thought I'd bring this into school tomorrow. I think it's a bad idea. You're just jealous. Mm. Now all we've got is this flaming book to deal with. Hopefully not many people around here will get their hands on it. Well, as long as Hope doesn't, that's the main thing. Oh, Esther and Mike have asked if they can meet at our flat. It were open, so we just thought we'd... Oh, hi, Billy. <clears throat> have you not told Billy about our arrangement? Me and Mike have been talking about a few things, and the only way we could have legal rights is to put Mike's name on the birth certificate. What do you mean, say he's a father and not me? But that's not true. It's the only thing we can think of that stops social services getting involved. I suppose we'll have to do it. You'll be fine. I just wanted to know if you'd heard anything from court. So they must be in there by now. I understand it's merely a formality, the exoneration. Yes. Uh, we still have some of that vegetable soup you profess to like. And so many lives have been ruined. I just pray that with time, Stu can rebuild his. You care about him very much, don't you? Yes, I do. My conviction was overturned. Eliza's going to need me to look after her. She needs her own room, so... I'm going to have to find somewhere else to live. <laughs> right! We should get to the cop shop. Just need a quick Jeffrey. I'm back in a sec. Okay. So do you want to get into Howard's pants or what? No. Wow. Well, he clearly wants to get into yours. You're not interested in helping me. You're just wasting my time and trying to get into my knickers. Excuse me, I'm not doing anything of the kind. Although, just out of interest, what sort of colour do you normally go for? Right, you need to back off right now, mate. I won't bother you anymore. I thought you'd come. I come in peace. I went to the police station to say that you're telling the truth about the robbery. No luck, I'm afraid. I did have an idea about how, even if we can't find her, we might still be able to draw her out. If she got wind that I'd won a small fortune in the lottery, she'd want her slice of it. What? Yesterday, after I left, she saw me and she says, you stick up for me because your lot always stick together. Can I have a quick word? Well, I just want to make sure there isn't a problem. You're the one making it a problem. <laughs> Florin, no one likes to be called out for being racist. It's just a misunderstanding. <laughs> <laughs> That's what they all say. They say their lot. You mean? What do you think I mean, Max? <sighs> Muslims. What I'm going to show you is going to educate you way more than anything you'll hear in school. Nobody's allowed to tell the truth, not nowadays. What? Maybe what she said was the truth. Yeah, so she's lying, is she? Yeah, I think she is. Oh, go on, why would she do that? Why do you think? You have to talk to Max. He started saying how our lot all stick together. What a surprise. You choosing someone else's side over mine again. Yeah, speaking of messages, I think we need to send one to that lot over at the curry place. What kind of message? 